We're getting set up for today's class, everybody. What is up, Andre? We're gonna be waiting for some people to pile up, to pile up, to pile up, to pile up, to pile up. Jay, to pile up, to pile up. What, what is the surprise, Julie? I'm doing a live right now. Okay, can I go check it out later? Now I'm doing a live video. You want to say hi to everybody? Oh, no, no, no. You don't want to say hi? Oh, that kitty bed. Look, let's say hi to everybody. Say, look, there. Huh? Say hi, everybody. Mm. No? Okay. Nope. Okay, you don't want to say hi? It's okay. What is up, everybody? Victor, we're just waiting for some people. Um, to get online, so we're gonna go over some good stuff today, man. We're gonna go over from Facebook equals cheap conversions. So, guys, 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 and girls, we're gonna be hanging out for Probably 20 minutes, probably 50 minutes, probably 40 minutes. I don't know, depend on you, how busy you guys keep me. <laughs> I just want to say hello to everybody. It's a little bit hard for me to read the comments from far away, but I can see everybody. So guys, uh, I have a camera here, I have a camera here, I have a camera there. We're live on Instagram here, we're live on Facebook, and we're live on YouTube. So guys, I just want to say, first of all, Thank you so much. Oops, I just gotta flip the screen, flip the screen. Give me one second, guys. My bad. My bad. Boom. Boom. What about now? Now you can read it, right? Yeah. Cool. So first of all, first of all, guys, I just wanna say, follow me, please, on Gabriel Beltran, T-E-M. It's facebook.com forward slash Gabriel Beltran. Let me write it down. Okay? You got to follow me here because I'm going to start doing lives like this, but on my Facebook page, not on this page. It's going to be Gabriel Beltran T-E-M for the Eco Millionaire. You, everybody got that? Please. Um, forget, um, not forget, remember that and take a screenshot or something. I don't want you to leave this live, but remember to like this page because I'm going to start going live on that page, okay? On Gabriel Beltran, T-E-M. Uh, follow me on Instagram, the Econ Millionaire. Just the Econ Millionaire. Is Snapchat the same? Snapchat is just Econ Millionaire. Snapchat, it's Econ Millionaire. So, Snapchat, okay? If you want to support the boy, Ecom Millionaire. Instagram, the Ecom Millionaire. And Insta, Instagram, the Ecom Millionaire. Okay? Please follow me in those channels so we can, we can connect a little bit more. And if you like the videos and you dig the content, uh, what I'm trying to do, guys, is honestly <coughs> help other people. Just to succeed on Facebook advertising and e-commerce in the... That someone called me, but uh, I cannot answer right now. The Econ Millionaire Jumpstart. If you bought, if you are new to the industry and if you bought the Econ Millionaire Jumpstart, you're getting access to this sent by email. It's a USB black card. It contains pretty much a Jumpstart. It contains literally how to open your store, how to run ads. I give you 10 products. I give you a product I'm running and I'm offering you a case study where you can model my $1 million a month with this. So, back to the training. What I want to share with you guys is something that I share with everybody on the event. And um, a lot of people got confused. But the people who get it, I think they're going to get really, 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 really good results. It's because we're talking about blue ocean, red ocean. So. Let me explain a little bit about that and see if you guys agree, if you, see if you guys like the idea. So we got the red ocean, okay? 
we got the blue ocean. Okay, red ocean, blue ocean. Red ocean, what it is, it's pretty much interest, interest, uh, behaviors, um, all the stuff that you target, okay? This ocean, it's full of sharks, okay? Full of sharks. Now, you wanna tap into the blue ocean, which uh, it's nothing, it's pretty much your ocean. This is what? This is custom audience. And lookalikes. Okay? So that's why you want to move in from your blue ocean to your, I mean from red ocean to blue ocean. How do you do that? Well guys, we know, we know very clearly that we test 10 ad sets with $10 each. The reason why I recommend 10 is because you want to cover as much ground as possible and the way we do $10 each it's to do and actually like fishing, right? It's like fishing. So what we want to see is pretty much which ad set is going to get us the sales, okay? So once we launch 10 ad sets, I'm going to walk you through it. So if you guys are just arriving to this live, don't worry, you can review it later, but it's going to be a lot of knowledge, okay? A lot of golden nuggets. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten ad sets, okay? Ten ad sets. And hear me out clearly because here's where it gets interesting. So let's say we're targeting, well, let's do bloggers. Bloggers, okay? Cameras. Okay, and then how, how I get to cameras? I'm targeting bloggers because it's, let's say, it's 20 million plus. I want to go with big interest, big, big, big interest. 20 million, 10 millions and up. Uh, I, I, I even target 200 million, like huge interest. And then how do you do it? Is you click and suggest it. And now Facebook is going to give you the most highly targeted rela uh, related, um, pretty much interest to that main keyword. Make sense, guys? I want interaction. Say yes, makes sense. Thumbs up, hearts, give me some love. Give me some love Instagram. I'm sorry. I got you down here and I got Facebook down there, but don't worry, man We can get you up to speed too. We I love you both YouTube Instagram Facebook. So check it out guys When we click suggested Okay suggested Facebook is gonna give us more targets and what we're gonna do is pretty much Hold on my cable is getting stuck. It's gonna give us bigger interest bloggers cameras then we can do, of course, Canon, what I'm using, Sony, what I'm using. Uh, we can do Mac, just, just shooting, shooting interest, right? We can do Windows, just to give ideas. We can do uh, editing, edit, edit, editing, and et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, okay? So, we let it run three days, three days, three days, three days. The third day, okay? The third day we're gonna analyze. Okay, those are binoculars. Right there. Okay? Cool. Awesome. Ding 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 ding. So we're gonna analyze day three. Day three, which one has sales? Okay, dude! I got three sales right here. Simple guys. I got three sales in cameras. I got Zero cells in this one, I got zero cell in that one, I got one cell in that one, I got zero here, zero here, and so forth and so forth. Zero. No, dude, 200 million is actually a product that you can scale to the moon. So every time I look for a product that I'm going to destroy, it's scaling, it has to be massive appealing and has to be a huge audience. If you look for a product that only has 4 million, guys, you're going to reach 4 million with like a $3,000 spent. You're gonna go through that audience like that. So that's what I'm saying. Focus on over 10 million plus to get huge big interest. 34 million, 35 million, 100 plus is my favorite, okay? So what you're gonna do is this simple, guys. Third day, where you have sales, check it out. I have five sales here and I got three sales here. So remember, all this, all this, we want to create a custom, audience as soon as possible 
Okay? Our custom outing is gonna be our what? It's gonna be our what? Let's see who knows. Let's see who see. Let's see who knows. Let's see who pay attention. What is gonna be our custom outings? What is gonna be our custom outings? Can someone answer that for, that for me? What is gonna be our custom outings? Our blue ocean! Someone did it? No. Our blue ocean! That's what I wanna tap in into a blue ocean custom outing. So here's how you get a super highly turbocharged, like, like supercharged lookalike custom outings. Let me give you a tip so you can actually implement this and let me know how it works for you. Okay, you're gonna do a custom audience based on the interest that I got you the sales. Let me repeat that. You're gonna do a custom audience based on the interest that got you the most sales. Why? Because if we do a custom audience and I'm starting with a 95% complete video views, what I'm doing right now, guys, remember, we always use the same, same what? Post. Post what? Who got the answer? We always use the same post for every interest. Every interest, we want to send it to what? To the same post ID, which is one ad. To do what? To create numbers. What numbers? Shares, likes, comments, okay? And shares. Because why? Monkey see, monkey do. So, if you have an ad, guys, with no engagement, no likes, no numbers, people ignore that stuff. People tend to uh, pay attention where they see something is going viral. They want to be part of that movement. Make sense? So, I was asking if you have an asset at $3, do you still use it for three days? Well, $3, I will leave it for a little bit longer because $3 is not enough money, but um, if you do three dollars in three days and you start seeing results, I will start scaling and testing bigger budgets because what is kind of what is gonna end up happening with three dollars is that your account is like an elastic, right? It's like an elastic. So the day you want to do a hundred and fifty dollar asset or five hundred dollar asset, you're gonna have on budget a red warning that is gonna say, "Warning: You're about to spend more money than you used to." Who has seen that? Click like or give me a heart if you have seen that. Have you seen that when you put a bigger budget, you see a warning from Facebook that you have to uh, pretty much ignore when you try to go to a bigger budget? Have you seen that or not? Yes, yes, okay. That is why your elastic needs to be stretched out. That means that uh, your account is not used to spend as much money, and when you go from $3 to a duplication of 75 bucks, most likely it's not gonna give you positive results. Why? It's because your account needs to optimize to uh, that budget level. That's why I test it out. Sometimes I uh, open a brand new account and I go from the get-go, $1,000 daily budget on a manual bid. That way I control the traffic, and by controlling the traffic, I'm also stretching the account optimization on, on the budget level. So, make sense? Are you guys digging that? You guys like that? Say yes, comment yes if you like that. Should I keep, continue? Should I keep going on? Give me likes, give me likes guys. I want to see engagement. Why? Because the most like you guys give me, the more love, the more I'm gonna reach my audience, my friends, people who follow me. That's the algorithm for you, Facebook. So if you see likes, 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 hearts, 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 that's actually helping me to reach more people. Thank you, appreciate that, guys. So the first audience that I'm gonna tap in is to actually 95. The second audience that I'm gonna tap in is to add to carts because there's a lot of people who have a bunch of add to carts and they got no purchase. So what I wanna do, what I wanna do if I know that the product has potential, it's create a lookalike on add to carts and test it out again. So, Here's how do I tap into the blue ocean, super highly targeted audience. Are you guys ready for that? Are you guys ready for that? <laughs> cool. So guys, it's pretty simple. We're gonna focus, instead of sending every single interest on traffic from video views, PP, and website conversions to the same post ID, now that I know, dude, I got five sales and three sales right here, this is what you want to do. You wanna combine these two interests if there are two, if there's one, I just do one. But in this case, since I got five and three, hey, I'm happy. So I'm gonna combine that and I'm gonna target as an ad, okay, a brand new ad. This is a new video, okay? New video. 
actually same ad copy, same everything, shop now, here, same ad copy, blah, blah, blah. Why? Why? Let me explain you why. It's because you want to separate when you create a custom audience to a specific video that are only these two interests are sending traffic to it. Why? Because I want Facebook to actually create a custom audience only from the traffic that is giving me the conversions. Make sense, guys? Any questions so far? I'll let you take a picture. I'll let you take a picture. You want to launch. I'm going to repeat it. You're going to launch a couple interests, which happens to be the ones that are getting you sales, with a brand new ad, brand new post ID that you're going to save and you're going to identify. Are we still recording this camera? Are we good on this one? Good. It's right, cool. I was at Adam and I wearing the TMN shirt. Sure. Bro, you know why? I give them all away. <laughs> And I forgot to say one for myself, man. I was yesterday, I was actually, man, what did I do with my the e-commerce millionaire shirt? And I give them all away, even mine, man. But don't worry, we got more coming in. We got more. So uh, we're going to do two interests targeted with one post ID to that one. So now what we're doing now, can I, can I delete that? You guys want to take a picture? You guys want to take a picture? Can I move on? Can I delete that? Say yes if I can move on. That way I can just erase that and move on. So I'm saying, do you do all three? Website conversions, video views? Yes, 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 yes. And the reason why, guys. So you add. The reason why, it's when you have a brand, brand, brand new ad, remember monkey see, monkey do. You want to have a video with a lot of views and a lot of engagement. That's why I ran a video view for 25 bucks just to give me the views. And I ran a PPE at 25 bucks just to give me the engagement, hearts, love, wall faces, comments, all the stuff, shares. That's what you want to do. You don't want to run it forever and ever and ever, but it is recommended to run it on the back end at least five bucks a day so you can have some type of engagement and fresh new eyeballs. But uh, I concentrate on website conversions when I'm going to scale. It's all website conversions and lookalikes. I do not scale successfully, honestly, with an interest. I get better results by going broad when I scale and I already have a pixel already on fire going broad with no target, then just targeting an interest. An interest is gonna be like this. Why? It's because it's a red ocean, meaning your targeting audience is being a lot, a lot competitive because you now have a lot of advertisers pushing the same product in the same interest, targeting the same people. So remember, it's got Facebook is gonna give, uh, it's gonna be showing the same ad pretty much to the same audience. So that's why it's not gonna convert. Some days yes, some days no. Depend on the competition. That's why when you type in, when you tap in, I'm sorry, not type, when you tap into your blue ocean, which is your own custom audience based on the highest conversion interest you're gonna actually lower the cost per purchase. Make sense? Should I continue going? Are you guys digging that? Yes, yes, yes? Give me some love, give me some comments. Cool. We go saying, what about add to cart? What is the size of the for, for pixel, add to cart? Mm -hmm. What about add to cart audience? Add to cart audience. Okay, Facebook will start populating your add to cart audience with about 500, 300 is what I recommend. But even with 100 uh, add to carts, you can actually start populating a lookalike audience. And then your lookalike will be like a baby growing and growing and growing and growing because the more add to carts you fit into the lookalikes, the better we'll get. Make sense? The better we'll get. So, um, 100 lookalike, 100 add to cards, just create a custom audience and just test a lookalike and you gotta get better results than the interest himself. So keep going guys. Now that we have a custom audience, okay, it's gonna be on engagement, video, 95% uh, video views, okay? And this one is gonna be a specific post ID, ID from, from the interest, the winner interest, okay? And that one is gonna be the super powerful uh, custom audience lookalike. Then we're gonna do a lookalike from that. We're gonna do a lookalike. And I wanna test 1%, I wanna test 2%, 3%, all the way up to 10%, okay? That's what we wanna do. What are we doing? Same thing, guys, same thing. One, two, three, four, five, six. Every single lookalike, every single lookalike is gonna be, you can test it at $10 or so 25 bucks or 75 bucks, depending on how confident you are and how 
how's your budget, right, for scaling. Sometimes when I feel confident, I just throw 75 bucks and I collect the data in one single day so I don't have to wait too much. But that is up to you, it's up to you. Okay, so I'm gonna launch every single one of those which are gonna be super highly targeted, <clears throat> muscle power targeted, laser focused because it's coming from an audience that you fitting now with red apples, okay? What we're doing is pretty much separating the, the, the sour apples and we end up giving Facebook prime bucket of red apples and saying, Facebook, I want more of this, more of this, more of this. So. That's what you do guys, that's what you do, it's actually tapping into your blue ocean traffic and once you have that, actually, you know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna just share that for now so now we don't, we don't get confused and uh, actually leave more topics for another day but guys, I want you to test that, please, I want you to test that and let me know on the comment section below, uh, whatever videos, if you follow me on, on YouTube, this video is gonna be on YouTube too so you can actually go back and watch it if you don't want to watch it and actually Facebook, but I, as soon as we finish the live, you're going to be able to review it again, review it again, review it again, okay? So that is how I call and how I create my blue ocean, okay? Other than that, guys, other than that, I just want to say something. Do not procrastinate, do not procrastinate because a lot of people procrastinate a lot. They think a lot, they think, oh, what should I do, what should I do, what should I do? What you have to do is actually sit in front of your computer and launch campaigns, launch campaigns. The more campaigns you launch, the better results you're gonna get at it. Remember, Facebook is like painting, dude. I'm just giving you what works for me and strategies that I like to test myself and when I see good results, I share. I'm not gonna share something that I'm not using myself, okay? So that's why I'm telling you, um, man, Creating a lookalike from actually an interest that is giving you the sales is the most smart stuff you can do, you know? But it has to be a big interest. It has to be a big interest. And make sure you don't mix uh, the interest by reviewing that every time, every time you duplicate an ad set, you have to make sure that the post ID, okay? You have to make sure that the post ID, it's a specific one. It's that specific one because if you start duplicating when you create the, the first test at, at, from the beginning, what you're going to end up is duplicating the ads. You're going to be duplicating ads and you're going to end up with a bunch of ads. So how do you review that? You're going to go to Power Editor to the Ad window and you're going to highlight them all and you're going to check one by one. And what I like to do is actually I open one and Facebook with comments and I copy on the URL. I copy the post ID, whatever, A11, whatever, whatever, whatever. I copy that one, I highlight them all, I go to use existing, use existing, and I do ID, and I enter the post ID right there, okay? So I make sure, and I double make sure, because that happens so many times to me, that I end up with a bunch of video, and remember, you wanna have one video going viral. Okay, so you gotta make sure guys in Power Editor that in your ad column that every single ad has the same post ID, the way you do it really quickly, it's you open one on Facebook comments, you copy the last post ID on the URL and you paste them on all and that's how you do it. So guys, I'm actually gonna let you go now because I have to make another video, but I'm gonna take five minutes for a Q, uh, quick Q&A. So hopefully you guys are getting some value out of that. If you're new to Facebook advertising, you have no idea what the hell I'm talking about. Guys, um, this is for you, for someone who doesn't know what's going on. Someone who actually has a job and wants to learn the business. This is the cheapest way, it's actually $67. And what are you paying from? It's actually you getting access. You're, uh, sorry guys. You're actually getting access to a live event for one day near your city and you pick and choose what city you want us to be and what's the convenience day. So we're gonna be maybe LA, Chicago, New York, Miami. We're gonna be touring pretty much the United States with the event. So once you get this, if you have no clue about Facebook and you're brand new, I promise you what I put here is going to make you make sales. That's going to build your confidence. It's going to make you believe in this business. And after that, you're going to actually realize 
and see that the blueprint we use for building your online business works. On the live event we had, we have a sold out event, that's why many, 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 many of my friends couldn't attend and that's why I didn't even promote it. It's because it was already sold out and more than 20 people got sales the first day. I'm talking about $300 first day from the get-go just by copying me the product that I researched live on the event and I said, look, let's test this product out. I open a brand new store, brand new pixel, brand new account and, and we may sell. So there's no excuses, guys, when you follow the proven strategy. So we're gonna answer some questions. For more information, that's a message you Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Got I'm spend money, spend money, spend money, you don't get results, you feel frustrated and what happens is that you are taking all the frustration and stress from your current situation and job and actually bearing it down to your new business. So your new business, you need to approach it with a clear mindset. Do not procrastinate and believe in yourself that you're gonna make it happen for you and for your family in 2018. And that's it for today. So we're gonna get to the Q&A real quick, guys. I wanna answer some questions. My bad. Without the iPad, boost. And also asking about look like audiences. Do you create them for other countries as well? Yeah, yeah, yeah. First look like I'm gonna create is the United States because why? I have a warehouse in the United States that I wanna leverage. As soon as I have a product that I can scale, I can bring those product in bulk, I can buy 50 units at the same time, 100 units at the same time, ship it to your US warehouse within four days and then deliver it within one to two days in US and Canada. Canada and probably three. How many products should they launch a day? Oh man, I have a team uploading 10 products a day you can also test 10 products a day if you have the budget, but that's my strategy. I'm testing right now, 10 products Mondays, 10 products Wednesday, whatever, after three days I can scale, I scale, and the team just keep going, just keep going. Do you duplicate ads and change the targets? 
I duplicate. No, 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 no. You, yeah, of, of course. You're gonna start with one ad set, then you duplicate that ad set in nine. That way, you have ten, and then you just change the targets. Yes, correct. Do you do uh, dark posts? Yeah, dark posts. Yes, sir. Indeed. Whoo, dark. Is the next event in Miami? The next event in Miami. That's a good one. Maybe. Yes. Possible. It's going to happen. Event in Miami is going to happen. When scaling to another account, if that is a new account, would it affect the results? No, actually, if you test multiple accounts, the, the, the results you're going to get is you're going to find out different CPMs and one account is going to be more profitable than the other one. Gianni says, how do I become a ninja? A ninja, like this. Wow! Shoot! Like that, dude. Ooh. <laughs> Gianni. Rico says, do we duplicate the winning ad before we make the lookalikes? Do we do do? Go ahead again. Go ahead again. We duplicate the winning ads before we make the lookalikes. Yeah, you can do that, but remember, you want to start scaling a lookalikes, not an interest. Interest is gonna be like this, like a red ocean. You can be on a on a huge wave, and then a shark is gonna eat you alive, and you're gonna be like, "What the hell happened today, man? I was crushing it yesterday, and today I have no sales." It's because depend on the competition, guys. Depend on the competition. So I will highly recommend you to pump traffic and build a lookalike as big as you can. I'm saying build a custom audience with the most add to cards that you can do and the most video views that you can do. That way you can start focusing on the lookalike instead of your your chest interest. <clears throat> so wants to know you teach messenger bots. Messenger bots. Look, Facebook does not like too much right now messenger bots. I was doing um, I was doing many chat and I haven't done anymore because Facebook does not like it. Actually, if you guys are still unaware, Facebook does not allow you to put share and tag your friends anymore. If you use share and tag your friends anymore, your ad is not gonna get any reach and your ad is gonna get pushed to the bottom of the page. Why? It's because by using chats and bots like that, that people say comment yes, and when they comment yes, automatically they get subscriber to a bot. Facebook don't 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 doesn't like why Facebook doesn't like that. I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I don't know if you, but hey, I'm thinking because look, Facebook offers you to build uh, campaigns for leads, right? But if you're now all of a sudden you're using a bot who is not owned by Facebook and now you're getting five to 10 cents leads instead of using their services, which is to get leads, they're not gonna like that. That's why I think that they, they, they literally completely remove. If you do tag and share and post and comment yes for that shit, I don't, they, they can even ban your account. So I wouldn't, I wouldn't talk about bots anymore. I will focus on front-end traffic and uh, uh, email marketing and retargeting, man. How yeah. Do you, how do you know a winner from the beginning? How do you know a winner from the beginning? You get sales from day one. Sales from day one. Three, four sales day one. Once you get sales from day one and you spend 25 bucks in an asset and you, you, that asset is profitable. From the day one, it's a winner, dude. It's a winner. Now, can you force a loser to be a winner? Yes and no. I wouldn't like you to force a loser to be a winner, but in my case, let me just share the story with you. One second, guys. Who knows this? Who remembers that? Who remembers that? This is branded to my, my, my stuff. It's um, branded. So, let me show you. Shit. Damn, it's so hard to get out! Come on! Anyway, look. I don't wanna share. You guys already know what it's up. You guys already know what it is, right? So, this product, actually, this product, okay? The reason why I branded myself is because I was killing it with this product in US and I decided to brand it myself and grow my, grow my brand. And this product was a loser for me. It was a loser. How do I make it a winner? How do I make it a possible? How do I make it possible to make over $2 million in this product? Doing that, doing that, targeting lookalikes and moving cold outings to warm outings. I was losing money on this shit 
till I move it to blue ocean. And that's why I'm saying, can you force a loser to be a winner? You can, depend on you how much money you wanna take, how much profit you're willing to take. In my case, this stuff made me between 19 to 22% revenue, uh, profit from the store revenue. So, hey, dude, as long as I'm getting ROI, I don't care, man, I'm happy. If I find a winner, if I only had PayPal, listen, bro, if I only had PayPal with this product, I'll have probably 45% returns from the revenue of the store. Because when I had PayPal, I was doing 6x, meaning if I spent a thousand, I, I made 6,000, and after PayPal went down, I went down like 60%. But I kept going, man, because uh, it's not the end of the world. I'm still working on getting people fixed, but it's a, it's a complicated topic. So if you're using PayPal, just be careful, you know. Take it like a savings account because once you start scaling, they're going to do like that. And uh, if you don't have the right contact, you're in, in big trouble. So next question, and we got to go. All right. After video views, it says how many, where should they start creating the custom and the look like audiences? After how many video views? Sorry guys, interrupted my call. Um, look, you wanna create your custom outing from day one, okay? And that's what we teach inside the Econ Millionaire. From day one, you wanna also build everything out because why waste time, right? Why waste your time if uh, you know the product or, or you have an eye for the product? So I, I create the custom outing from day one and by day three, by day three I'm already creating lookalikes because I'm running $100 per day on a product. Okay, and I'm running worldwide, so with worldwide, it's gonna get me a lot of auto cards. So from day three, I'm already creating a view, video views 95%, which is equals to $300 spent, more or less. Next question. Okay, guys, love you all, keep in touch. Remember, if you're new to this and you have no idea, message me on Gabriel Bertrand TEM fan page to become part of the Eco Millionaire Jumpstart or the Eco Millionaire Mastermind or the Eco Millionaire Family, okay? We're growing, we're growing. We're not going anywhere. We never stop. Bye-bye. <laughs> yeah!